You have to discard a shark? Yo, what up, everybody? It's Peace Eye. Welcome to another video. Uh, Tony just held the locals very uh, kindly for us. Seven people showed up. Uh, I went X uh, and a draw. So two wins and a draw <laughs> with uh, Zodiac, Trickstar, Sky Striker, Orcus. Oh, man, what an innovative deck idea. Thank you very much. Um, I blinded second, um, and I just wanted as many extenders as possible. Um, I might mess around with Altergeist later, but for now, uh, this is just going to be my deck. All right, so for normal summons, we got Armageddon Knight, Dark Greffer, Triple Scrap Recycler. This is pretty standard for the decks. Um, I don't play Mech Knight Orcus Girsu because of a combo with Lib. So, Mech Knight Orcus Girsu, when it's summoned again for the turn, you can't activate its effect to dump again. But these are not once per turn. So if you use these, you can special summon them again and use them again. So I'll I'll uh, explain that a little bit later. But these are better than Mech Knight Orcus Girsu for my deck. Alright, um, Orcus Dungeon, we've got two, 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 and one. So yeah, your win condition, your so pretty you standard. Go first, right? Yeah, so uh, and then for the other monsters, seven, we got a Dino Wrestler Pankertops in the main because we're blinding Please second. Please explain the logic the behind. We're blinding this. second, and we want really to have good all. cards what that we can special two, summon to the field to link up into our lib. Interesting. So, very to, broken. Uh, we got the Trickstar Corobane. Uh, this special summons oh, when yeah. it's. Uh, uh, you control no cards except for Trickstar monsters, and then uh, a Zodiac Whiptail. So that's all the monsters. No hand traps. Uh, next is spells. Uh, we play a lot of power spells. Uh, field spells are Trickstar Light Stage, Triple Mystic Mine. We're going second deck. <laughs> Sorry guys. And then the one Orchestrated Babble. I thought Mystic Mine wasn't that great this format. What what changed your mind? Uh, my friends uh, don't have Ad Emancipator or Eldritch, so Mystic Mine is actually pretty OP still. Um, next up, I've got uh, the Sky Striker engine. This is really useful. Uh, there's a this is really heavy spells. Um, this just gives you a free monster on board, and then you can go Shizuku and search at end phase. And this just steals monsters and pops stuff. Uh, next up, we got a, a, some more power uh, spells. We got Rhoda to search your Armageddon Knight, Foolish Burial to dump an Orcus monster, Monster Reborn, uh, Upstart Goblin. Reasoning, you just play so many different levels that you just you always hit this. I mean, they're never going to call it right ever. Um, you got your terraforming to search all your broken field spells. You got your set rotation to set your broken field spells. The one zodiac barrage. Um, you know that you can normal whip tail. I didn't realize that until later. Uh, and then so those are all the ones that are at one. Then we've got uh, one world legacy succession. You search this off of lib. Uh, then you got the one orchestrated return. You're not playing as many orcus count in this deck, so you just play the one. And then for traps, triple impermanence. This is a pseudo hand trap, but it's mainly for uh, stopping floodgates or impermanencing your opponent's board before they can do things uh, to negate your turn. Anyway, um, two strikes, uh, just in case you are going first. So you just have some backup strikes is really good. I, I like it better than like judgment and warning. Uh, and then the one crescendo that for follow up. All right, let's go to the extra deck. You got your one Zodiac Dryden's. This is really useful for popping stuff, and then you can use it as link material. And then your two Dingirsu. So those are all the XCs. The rest are links. You got double Galatea. Uh, two always comes up, so super broken. Uh, long Girsu. This can send uh, your opponent's monsters, and then like if you get cherries on your Galatea, you can shuffle both of them back in the extra deck by this. Uh, then the Striker Engine, I didn't use it this tournament, but theoretically it's really good. I don't know, I might play a Ray or something in this deck, but you know what these two do. Um, we got IP Mascarena, Barricade Borg Blocker. Uh, this broken card, like I said, with the Mech Knight Workers gear, so you can't summon, um, you can't use its effect twice, so uh, the other ones are better for this. Then you got your Nightmare Package. Uh, these two are pretty good. And then finally... The top logic zero Boros for clearing boards, and then Boros Sword for game. Boros Sword with IP is indestructible. It's so good. Uh, next for side deck, we got our tokens: uh, Sky Striker token and the Nibiru token. Oh, nice. Trisbana. Uh, this one's really good with uh, against back row decks, uh, and with in combination with another side card that I'll show you. Shut up. <laughs> then we got double Nibiru. double Phantasmi. And then double Lancia. I'm sick of dinosaurs killing me, so I got Lancias in here, and then I got the Nibirus in the side as well. 
Uh, Secret double... Lancey, I last for two turns instead of one. <laughs> <laughs> I wish. <laughs> double Call by the Grave, um... Because this is just good against certain matchups, and it's really good for going first. Um, and then this card, uh, the uh, triple anti-magic arrows, it really uh, goes well with the Trisbana, because you could easily put uh, three monsters on board before special summoning again, and then you just clear your opponent's back row. And then finally, triple evenly matched. So that's the profile. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe for more, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.